Rampage. Welcome back, Konosuke Takeshita. Match is awesome. Um, so there was a lot of you know we just mentioned match may have been it might be a four and a half star match. A lot of people think there was a you know a match of the year contender happy this weekend. Uh, this match is the match I'll probably rewatch first out of anything from AEW slash Tony Khan this week. I think this um, is my favorite match. It's awesome. Of the, it's awesome. It, it's either that or the tag title match from Wednesday. Um, there are the matches, the two matches I like the most. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, they had a match, they had a match earlier this year that was also awesome. This one was a, a sequel to it and like it shows the progression of the is now like instead of he got put away, like he gets get to the point to where they do the, he gets hit with the um, with the paradigm shift and it's seemingly over, and this fucker kicks it one, and like I am immediately transported back to the beginning of the year when um Yuta is fighting to get into Blackpool Combat Club, and like Yuta gets fucking mollywopped, gets his ass kicked, he's bleeding all over the place, and then he gets hit with a paradigm shift, and Yuta kicks it two, and like it for me that was kick out of the year, but like. But this is like off a of one count, and I was like, "Fuck, goddamn, this is good." Um, and I was in for the rest of, for whatever was remaining of the match. But like, yeah, man, the crowd from that point on was like rooting for Takeshi to fucking uh, fight in in fight and Ooh, fight, Moxley. and and um, you know, ultimately he's getting put away. But like, yeah, man, like this is like when they announced the match on the screen before uh, on uh, Dynamite, and the crowd popped for the match. It was like. He's a no entity now. Like it's not like he just comes out, you know, on the ramp, puts his arms in the air, and then like they're kind of quiet, and then he has the matches, and then they go off. Like they remember him, they believe in him because of the level of matches he's had, and um, now it's just a matter of getting him in a program or getting him in a situation. Like obviously they're doing something with him and Callus, but like getting him to where like they're uh, like they can see the momentum of this guy can win big matches against a big star, and it's gonna happen eventually. It is time to start the push. Um, it's like this guy is incredible. Um, and he he had a, like just a rash of matches earlier this year that I, I don't know if like I don't want to say people don't remember because I think they do remember. But it was almost like, OK, it was cool for him to lose those ones. Now it's like, we're let, let's get to the wins. Like people want this guy to win. Uh, I think he should end up being the first Japanese wrestler to ever hold the AEW championship at some point. Um, <clears throat> and I said, he would be a big test as opposed to um, getting somebody when they were 37 years old to get them when they're 27 in America. And he's already a ready made main eventer already. Like, so there's not, as much, I think, growth needed in Takesh's uh, case. So the, I, they clearly have an interest in him. Like, I feel like these losses are kind of calculated. There's built-in yeah. stories for them. You mentioned the callous thing. That leads to thinking there's some type of elite thing with him. I think he's in good hands. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, yeah, like like when I, when I think about guys like that, I, I'm excited about the future for and that can define this promotion. Kanosuke Takeshita, run it up. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it's weird, right? Because, like, I think the first time we both saw him in the same, uh, the same match, uh, the Cyber Fight tag match, uh, had you seen him before then? I, I'd seen him before then. It's just funny because, like, the first, like, because uh, um, last year I was looking through my, my notes last year. Uh, for like uh, match ratings, and um, like, it's just funny, like because because this is when we were explaining, I was playing the day finish, like my, how I rate matches and whatever else, uh, like for stuff that's like uh, kind of like what my fallback is when I'm stuck in between a rating, um, and like I like, and I saw like uh, that cyber fight tag match of him and uh, Ueno versus um, Kaido Kiyomiya and uh, Yushiki and, 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 and uh, whatever kind of name, Yushiki, uh, big dude. But anyway, um, and it's just funny because like, it's my first time ever seeing him. I was like, oh, this is Pocket Okada. Mm-hmm. Um, like he's a 6'2 Okada, so obviously younger. Um, I think and, he gets more vertical and like probably does like more like power element stuff. He's, he's, I mean, he's, he's buffer. Yeah. 
Um, but that, but just like as far as just watching them, just like oh, it took me one watch to be like, oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, it's all it took. And then like to see it like he comes over here and is like. <laughs> All I saw was one match, and I fucking knew. Like, just imagine, what, like, this is why I finished shows. Like, he's a, like, he has like the charisma of the Ultimate Warrior just from wrestling, not from running down to the ring. It's like, yeah, he's fucking awesome. Uh, and you know, I'm interested to see like where they can take this and what his height, what the height this can be. But like, the in ring thing is not going to be a problem because he's just fucking fantastic. He's one yeah. of the best wrestlers in the world. He's been for years. If we just obviously, you know, it's DDT, so who the fuck can know? Um, or how many people possibly knew that from here? Um, but yeah, Mox adds another one on the board uh, at the end of the oh, year. Yeah. Um, so like, it was like, yeah, man, just just going to crank another one of these out. And I think he was sick too. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Shots to shots to him. So um, yeah, man, just rebirthing Rampage. I, I think I heard um, like even Brian and Vinny was like the match that saved Rampage or some shit like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> We had 